So, have you ever dreamed of the ultimate thrilling adventure? Brace yourselves, we are here at Tao, Volcano in Tagaytay, Philippines. This volcano is still very active. It's the second most active of all of the 24 volcanoes in the Philippines. Will we escape the volcano's fiery challenge? Click in now, you'll enjoy a beautiful and exciting adventure. Tao is the only volcano in the middle of a lake that's on an island. So, we'll go on a private boat to see it up close and personal. Plus, you'll discover the beauty of Tagaytay. It's not only a big destination for tourists, but you'll also discover that the locals call it a city of all occasions. It has a year-round mild climate and magnificent mountain views of Lake Tao. Here is the Pamana Restaurant. Tagaytay has many fine restaurants to dine overlooking the Tal Volcano. This is a great one for you to enjoy. We are visiting Mela's dad and brother who live nearby. We ate here for breakfast, and you can see how special it is. Yeah, right there. Here, please. Um, gula lung corn beef. Yeah, Yeah, the bacon. The corn beef, but it's bula style. Corn beef. Corn beef. Corn beef. Corn beef. Chocolateria, bitter sweet uh, chocolate from Pamana. Here are some pictures of lunch and dinner menu. So we zigzag down the steep slopes to get down to the lake. Lake Tao, formerly known as Bombon Lake, is 60 kilometers or 37 miles south of Manila. It is the deepest lake in the Philippines at 172 meters or 565 feet and is the third largest in the area. It's not every day you can take a beautiful boat ride to an active volcano. The thrill is real, but so is the danger.
So it looks peaceful on this volcano island now, but Mother Nature can always change her mind. She burned the trees from this island, and these black rocks are evidence of her wrath. A permanent reminder of where the lava flowed during the 2020 eruption, causing major disaster in fears for the worst. Well, it's time to head back, but no worries the boat ride back is beautiful and we have a great meal waiting for us. Here are the fish ponds, they are feeding the fish now. Tilapia and milkfish are found in rivers, ponds, and lakes all through the Philippines. Fish are harvested after 3 to 5 months. The success of fish farming is attributed to the suitability of the fish to Philippine conditions. everybody we really appreciate it we just saw this video right here it's one of ours and it's actually recommended to you <laughs>